I've heard others talk about uh, the law of attraction or abundance affirmations that attract more than enough to you. I have a slightly different approach to money affirmations or maybe a really different approach to money affirmations. Sometimes I think it's less about the money and more about enjoying life more. Sometimes it's more about personal growth than making our wallet fatter. Sometimes it's about healing or values or time freedom. If you're looking for money affirmations that go beyond, I am a magnet for money, I am a magnet for money, then you're in the right place. Here are my top 10 money affirmations that go beyond money to total life transformation. Welcome to the Fife Movement. I'm your host, Amanda Neely. This is the only movement that helps our generation create our unique feminine and entrepreneurial approach to financial independence. Please be sure to subscribe and hit the bell for future videos. Now, I've never been a huge fan of mantras, but I was totally using them before I knew what they were. In college, I had this mantra that helped me tremendously when I was unsure who I was and what I was doing. It was, God, you have my heart and I know you will protect it. I went to a pretty competitive school with debates every night in the dining hall around the dinner table. It was hard not to take things personally, but this phrase stuck with me and helped me through it. It was almost a, like a little prayer I could say in my head anytime, and it was, I said it often, God, you have my heart and I know you will protect it. It helped me through a lot of relational ups and downs too, if you know what I mean. <laughs> and for a while in business, I had another mantra that uh, was one that just helped me get through. It was just put one foot in front of the other, just put one foot in front of the other. It was in the time before finding Nemo, or it might've been just keep swimming, just keep swimming. <laughs> I would wake up in the morning, unsure what to do that day, or even if I wanted to get out of bed. And I would just say to myself, just put one foot in front of the other. And I knew I could totally do that. I could totally walk 500 miles if I needed to. Or, and so I would get out of bed and keep going with my day, no matter how hopeless the future seemed, because I knew I could just keep putting one foot in front of the other, one foot in front of the other. The reason I share these stories is because what happens in our heads right here dramatically impacts how we feel and what we do. If you want to have a better relationship with money, perhaps it could start with developing some new thoughts about money. And if you want to live a happier, healthier life, maybe changing your mind about something could help. Maybe there are affirmations or mantras that can do both help you with your money and help you live a happier, healthier life at the same time. Now, I totally want to be clear. These affirmations are not all name it and claim it per se. There might be something to putting a positive mindset out into the universe that leads to more wealth and health and happiness coming your way. Totally could happen. But from my experience, when I choose positive money affirmations and mantras, they change my mind and that changes all of me, my actions, my feelings, what, you know, all the things. And that's been way more important than any like cosmic things coming my way because of what I've changed. So I just want to put that out there. Lately, I've been toying around with devising some new and improved money models, mantras or affirmations that others might find helpful as well. So I want to share with you my core 10, and as I share them with you, see what sparkles or sticks out. I'm just going to read them. Um, in future episodes, I'm going to expound on them. But for now, I just want you to take them in, see, see what feels like something you want to dive into. So one, I spend less to enjoy life more. Two, I grow my income so I can be more generous and kind. Three, I can save more money than I previously thought possible. Four, I don't need or want to impress people I don't like. Five, 
What really matters is having time for what's most important. Six, I want my money to help me grow as a human being. Seven, I can talk openly and honestly about money. Eight, my past money mistakes are forgiven and my focus is on this moment. Nine, I can and will have total time freedom. And 10, my life is in service to my values rather than my time in service to my money. Now, these 10 phrases are going to be in the show notes. If you want to go back and read them again, um, see what sticks out to you, see what sparkles. For now, it's time for you to decide how you want to change your mind when it comes to money so that you can have a happier, healthier relationship with money. Maybe one of my 10 sparkled or stuck out to you. If so, try it on for size. Maybe you have something else that popped into your head or pops into your head as you go about your day today. Maybe you already have something that you want to reinforce and go deeper with your own affirmation or mantra or, um, you know, phrase. Wherever you are and whatever affirmation you want to adopt, take a step toward making it real by posting in the comments or emailing it to me at amanda at fifemovement.com. I look forward to hearing yours and maybe adopting it for myself and sharing uh, it with others if you give me permission. So go ahead, uh, open up, share it. That can often help you make it more concrete for yourself. And also, I'm going to come back to some of these in the next episodes and talk about what they mean to me and how they work their way from my head out into my actions. So hit that subscribe button so you don't miss those deeper dives. The next one I'm going to do a deeper dive on is money affirmation one, I spend less to enjoy life more. Thanks for joining me and connecting with the Fife Movement. As you go about your day, remember, wealth is coming your way. Your quest is to prepare for using it well. For more tips on how to prepare, be sure to subscribe. To connect with the community, visit fifemovement.com. And if my gift has helped you, please pay the gift forward by sharing this content with a friend. My gratitude in advance. To help this video be seen by more people, please hit the like button. And then, yes, we totally want to hear from you in the comments. Scroll down, share a money mantra, affirmation, a, a truism about money that you found helpful for yourself. Thanks. 